Hey friends, welcome to another episode of How. So friends, knowing the amount of time we spend on mobile, mobile holders is quite a common thing that is used nowadays. So how do we get this mobile holder? In case we do not want to get it and we want an easy way out, how do we make one for ourselves? We'll show you on how to do a mobile holder. As you see here, I have got an A4 size blue color paper, which I'm going to make use for to make the mobile holder. You'll remember in school, we had to make a square uh, kind of paper. So what we do, we fold the triangle half and then the remaining part, which is there, which is beyond the triangle we just uh, you know remove it off so that we have a square shape I'll just fold it and I'll just remove the balance part off so I have a nice uh, square shaped paper so from if a4 size we have this square shape paper I'll just um, tear off this place where I'm folding I'll give it a nice fold and I'll just tear it off with the knife just be careful when you all are using the knife so that you do not hurt yourself and there I'll get rid of that extra portion of the paper and there I'm gone I'm done with that now as you can see this square shape size paper that I have what I'm firstly going to do is I'm going to fold it exactly into half there exactly into half then I'll give it a nice press so that it's good to go and then I'll open and I'll fold it again into another half so I'll have two side equal halves fold see that now on the other side I'll fold it exactly to where the other side has reached exactly half of the full square shape paper there I'll just press it through there once I'm done with the fold of this half I will then refold this paper into a smaller square side towards the inner side of it nice press again and there I'll open it and now as you see I am trying to give it a triangular fold inwards at the exact half which I had got when I measured the paper into a square shape there see the same thing I will repeat on the other side as you notice I keep pressing it firmly the ends I keep pressing it so that I have a nice um, firm end it does not trouble me when I actually have to end up doing the folds there this is done on one side and I repeat the same thing folding process on the other side of the half end triangle shape next to the half that I have inwards again if you see I'm folding it all towards the inner side the same on the other side fold it inwards there you have this and as you can see I'll just open this up see I have this design kind of thing this diamond thing now on the end if you see of this paper I will push it inwards and bend push it inwards and bend which gives me like a WM kind of stuff and then I open one of the fold and the other side I will put it inside that open fold of mine there can you see I have like a pointed end for this side 
the same thing I'll do on the other side from the middle I will push it inwards so I have an M shape and then I'll just squeeze it in a little and I'll open one side of the fold and press the whole M shape leaving the outer part inside the fold and then put the fold over it so you see it looks like some boat kind of stuff like you know and then I'll just tilt it upwards and I'll give it a smooth soft bend on the middle portion now it looks like two diamonds two mountains there and that's exactly what is the mobile holder like just keep the mobile here and you can see I'm on one of my previous videos and there see quite nice quite stable no uneasiness turn it the other way and there it's balanced on the other way you just have to ensure that when you're keeping it like this it remains without any problem but when you keep it at a standing position just ensure that you balance it off properly before you leave your hand remove your hand from there and then once we are done with this and there your mobile holder number one is ready now the number two mobile holder that I have is for I'm going to make from this plastic bottle I will just cut the plastic bottle on the exact middle or the upper middle where the tiny tiny placements of rings are over again I'll make use of a knife just be careful mind your fingers when you're using the knife cut it all around and there I have the bottle cut into two parts and then I'll take a pair of scissors and I'll cut it on the inverse side okay I cut it in the form of a U from outside getting bigger and bigger so what happens to this bottle if you see the half you'll have one of the not firm ends the flexible ends I'm just cutting it more a little more deeper I'll tell you why at the nearing the end of this um, there see you'll have one firm side U side and one flexible side so the flexible side I will remove it off not exactly from the deep cut that I've done a little above the deep cut I'll just cut it off straight there I'm done and this portion of mine is gone I'll just remove it off and as you can see here I have this firm end I'll just shape it off a bit yeah so it's it's a little neat there now the firm end remains we are almost done with the holder but see now if I try to place my mobile just like this it will slide downwards so in order to avoid it what I'll do you remember the cut towards the depth right in front of it say about half a centimeter I'll just give another small cut okay and the side flap of it I'll bend it outwards you could cut the flap but I advise not cutting the flap because I feel it would be a kind of grip when you place the mobile see it's like open hands <laughs> welcoming the mobile and one second I'll just put the mobile on this thing mm, and there you go see lovely and you can I like this idea of the mobile holder but only thing you cannot place it straight only you can place it horizontally it's very good to watch videos from a distance and you know enjoy 
watching your videos there the next one is a bonus tip for those of you all who make use of glasses and have these boxes for your glass there for your specs not the ones which pinch in automatically the ones which are open wide there you can just adjust your mobile inside this and there that is a very quick and easy way to have a mobile holder the other way you could do is in the standing position again adjustment is required as it would fall off and you can just turn it around and you so friends hope you all enjoyed this diy mobile holder technique on how um i really enjoyed making it it was quite easy um it didn't take me time and you all can follow the instructions and you know have it done very easily um try this hack for those of you all who really struggle to buy one mobile holder or cannot go out because of the pandemic try to make this at home and let me know what was your thought while making this mobile holder has it been helpful to you for your usage of mobile holders so let me know about that in the comment section also do let me know if there is some kind of hack that we could work on to make life a little bit more easier this hack was a request from a very dear friend of mine and thank you marilyn for this request also i would like to tell all of those people who have not yet subscribed to my channel please do not forget and do click on the subscribe button along with the bell icon to get notifications on all of my upcoming videos i'll see you in another episode of how